After detecting an unusual wobble in space, astronomers were led to a startling discovery in our cosmic backyard. A monstrous dormant black hole named Gaia BH3. This slumbering giant lurks in the constellation Aquila, a mere 2,000 light years from Earth. The sheer scale of this object is enough to make one ponder. Could this sleeping giant one day awaken from its dormancy? Might it begin to devour everything around it, steadily growing until its gravitational pull reaches our precious Earth? To put this into perspective, our Milky Way galaxy spans 100,000 light years. So, while this distance may seem vast, on a cosmic scale, this black hole is practically on our doorstep. But its proximity isn't the only thing that sets Gaia BH3 apart. With a mass of a staggering 33 times that of our Sun, Gaia BH3 claims the title of the heftiest dormant stellar black hole ever found in our galaxy. Imagine 33 suns crushed down into an infinitesimal point, creating a gravitational abyss so powerful that not even light can escape. While the idea of a supermassive black hole consuming our planet is thought-provoking, Gaia BH3's true nature raises intriguing questions about these elusive cosmic entities and how they shape the very fabric of our universe. As we delve deeper into this discovery, we'll uncover the reality of whether or not our blue planet is truly safe from this sleeping giant. Join us as we explore the groundbreaking science behind this remarkable find and unravel the secrets of the monstrosity in our backyard. The story of Gaia BH3 is one you won't want to miss. Gaia BH3's discovery came about through the keen observations of the European Space Agency's Gaia satellite. Launched in 2013, Gaia's purpose is to create a detailed 3D map of a billion stars in our galaxy. As researchers combed through the wealth of data, they spotted a curious wobble in a star within the constellation Aquila. This peculiar movement hinted at the presence of an invisible companion, a black hole with a mass 33 times that of our Sun, pulling the star along in an orbital rotation. To confirm their suspicions, astronomers turned to the Very Large Telescope in Chile. Their observations verified the existence of a massive black hole, Gaia BH3, and revealed that its stellar partner completes an orbit around it once every 11.6 years. But what makes this discovery even more intriguing is the nature of the companion star itself. Analysis of the star's composition shows that it's an ancient relic believed to have formed within the first 2 billion years after the Big Bang. Its trajectory, moving against the flow of most stars in the Milky Way's disk, suggests a captivating backstory. Astronomers propose that this star was once part of a smaller galaxy that merged with our own over 8 billion years ago, long after the black hole had formed. The fact that the companion star seems unaffected by the cataclysmic supernova that would have given birth to Gaia BH3 suggests that the black hole likely captured the star long after its own formation. This cosmic interaction between the black hole and its companion offers a rare glimpse into the complex dynamics at play in the universe. As astronomers continue to study this system, they hope to unravel more secrets about the life cycles of stars and the formation of black holes. Gaia BH3's discovery also underscores the importance of missions like Gaia in expanding our understanding of the universe. By precisely mapping the positions, velocities, and trajectories of over a billion stars, Gaia is revolutionizing our view of the Milky Way and the objects they call it home. As the mission continues to collect data, astronomers anticipate even more groundbreaking discoveries in the years to come. The chemical makeup of Gaia BH3's companion star also sheds light on the formation of such considerable stellar black holes. It's thought that these cosmic heavyweights are born from the collapse of ancient, metal-poor stars. These primordial stars, consisting mainly of hydrogen and helium, tend to retain more of their mass throughout their lifetimes. When they finally exhaust their nuclear fuel and collapse, they leave behind black holes of exceptional size. While the discovery of Gaia BH3 is groundbreaking, it also highlights the challenges astronomers face in detecting these invisible giants. Scientists estimate that our galaxy could host up to 100 million stellar black holes. However, their elusive nature makes them incredibly difficult to pinpoint. Most don't have a companion star to betray their presence, 
which renders them virtually invisible to our telescopes. However, the study of black holes is not limited to detecting them through their gravitational interactions with nearby stars. In recent years, astronomers have made remarkable progress in observing black holes by way of detecting gravitational waves. These ripples in the fabric of space-time, predicted by Einstein's theory of general relativity, are created when massive objects like black holes collide and merge. The first direct detection of gravitational waves in 2015, originating from the merger of two stellar mass black holes, opened up a whole new way of observing the universe. As gravitational wave detectors become more sensitive, astronomers hope to detect the collisions of even more massive black holes, potentially revealing the existence of intermediate mass black holes that have so far eluded our detection. This new era of multi-messenger astronomy, combining observations from gravitational waves, electromagnetic radiation, and even neutrinos, promises to revolutionize our understanding of black holes and their role in shaping the cosmos. The formation of stellar black holes is a fascinating process, one that marks the end of a massive star's life. When these cosmic titans run out of fuel, they explode in a spectacular supernova, an event that can briefly outshine entire galaxies. What remains is a collapsing core, the fate of which depends on its mass. If the core is sufficiently heavy, it will continue to collapse into a singularity, a black hole. The precise tipping point at which a collapsing star becomes a black hole is still a mystery to astronomers. The threshold, known as the tolman oppenheimer volkoff limit, is a subject of ongoing research. However, current theories suggest that stellar processes cannot create black holes smaller than a few solar masses. If such lightweight black holes exist, they're likely primordial relics from the early universe. Gaia BH3, while a record breaker within the Milky Way, is still a relative lightweight compared to the supermassive black holes that lurk at the hearts of galaxies. Our own galaxy plays host to one such behemoth, Sagittarius A, a black hole with a mass 4 million times that of our Sun. Its immense gravity acts as an anchor, holding together the swirling mass of stars, gas, and dust that make up our galaxy. The origin of these supermassive black holes remains a topic of intense study and speculation. One theory proposes that they're born from the collapse of vast clouds of cosmic gas and dust in the early universe. Another suggests that they grow by consuming smaller black holes and stars that wander too close to their gravitational grip. As we consider the celestial interaction between this sleeping giant and its ancient companion star, one question still lingers in the minds of many. Could this black hole ever awaken from its dormancy and pose a threat to Earth? While the idea of a black hole suddenly devouring everything in its path may fuel our imaginations and ignite our fears, the reality is far less sensational. Gaia BH3, though an impressive find, is simply too far away to directly impact our planet. At a distance of 2,000 light years, even if this black hole were to become active and start consuming matter at a rapid pace, the effects would be negligible from Earth's perspective. Moreover, black holes don't just simply wake up and start roaming the galaxy in search of matter to consume. They're not vacuum cleaners, indiscriminately sucking up everything in their vicinity. Instead, black holes feed on material that comes close enough to be captured by their immense gravitational pull. In the case of Gaia BH3, its companion star is locked in a stable orbit. And unless some cataclysmic event disrupts this balance, the black hole is unlikely to embark on a feeding frenzy. It's also essential to remember that Earth is not stationary in the cosmos. Our planet, along with the entire solar system, is constantly in motion, orbiting the center of the Milky Way galaxy. This means that our distance from Gaia BH3 is not fixed, and over time we will naturally drift further away from this black hole. So, while the discovery of Gaia BH3 is undoubtedly fascinating and offers us a glimpse into the exotic realm of black holes, it poses no immediate threat to our planet. We can continue to study and marvel at these cosmic wonders from a safe distance, secure in the knowledge that Earth's fate is not tied to the whims of this sleeping giant.